It's hard to believe the world could ever run out of fresh water. Even though we live on a blue planet, only about 3% of Earth's water is fresh. Of that, only 1% can be used as drinking water, and that is threatened by climate change and growing populations. More than 1 billion people, from Madrid to Mumbai, struggle with access to fresh water every day. Growing up in and around the ocean is what led me to become a marine ecologist. Today, I travel the world photographing stories about marine science and conservation to help people better understand their connection with water. So I've always been really aware of the water I use, but I want to know what more can I do to save water? Well, here in the US, the average family uses about 300 gallons of water per day. That's like running a shower for two hours straight. Is it true that more than a third of the water we use goes towards keeping ourselves clean? It is. It's time that we realize that water won't always just flow from the faucets. We really need to rethink our relationship with the water that we use and waste every day. Take washing your hair, for example. Much of the water used in the lifetime of a shampoo or conditioner actually happens right in our showers or baths. And don't forget the environmental impact of heating all that water. So having a shorter shower and turning the water off while using products is a super easy way to make a big difference. Look for products like shampoo bars that are easy to rinse and over their lifetime use about 20% less water than liquid shampoos. And you could use products like leave-in conditioners or no-rinse conditioners that can help save up to 25 gallons of water per tube. So that's using products. What about making them? Some companies are really helping here by recycling and reusing their water for cleaning and cooling in the manufacturing process. No rinse conditioners, leave-in conditioners, solid shampoo bars, and recycling water in manufacturing are some of the steps Garnier are taking to save water as part of their green beauty journey. We can all take one step of our own to make our world a little bit greener.